Lisa and Marcus, I need to talk to you. What did we do wrong this time? Don't worry, you've done nothing wrong. Please come along for a minute. I'm afraid, Mr. Coons. You don't have to be afraid, Lisa. Just come along. Are we in trouble now, Mr. Coons? No, quite the opposite. I must apologize to you. I overreacted a bit last week. That was wrong. I'm so sorry. I accept your apology. Thank you, Marcus. No problem, Mr. Coons. Thank you, Lisa. As an excuse, I'll give you a day off. What, really? Yes. You can do what you want today. So, Marcus, what do we want to do? Are you hungry, Lisa? I'm a bit hungry already. Then come along. I still owe you an ice cream. Okay. How does the ice cream taste, Lisa? It tastes great. Thanks for the invite, Marcus. No problem. I love spending time with you, Lisa. I love spending time with you too, Marcus. You're really pretty. I wanted to ask you a question. Do you want to be with me? Lisa, what are you doing here? And who is that? Dad, I can explain that. That's Marcus. Why aren't you in school? Mr. Coons released us today. Marcus is a friend from school. I really like him. You're coming with me now. Why did you do that, Dad? Lisa, you're only 10 years old. You're way too young to date boys. What were you thinking? Marcus is super nice. You'd love him. I don't want to hear another word about it. What's the matter, darling? Why are you crying? Dad embarrassed me today. In front of my friend. You have a boyfriend? That is so nice. What is his name then? His name is Marcus. What's nice about that, Marie? Lisa is much too young for that. You'll have to get used to it sooner or later, honey. 
Do you really like Marcus, Lisa? Yes, I like him. Then let's invite his parents to dinner. What do you think, Lisa? That would be great. And what do you think, honey? I guess I'll have to accept it. Very good, then we'll do that on Wednesday. What do Marcus and Lisa eat? A. Sweets B. Cake C. Ice cream Write a